Hey guys, it's Des with Des Says, and today I'm going to be talking all about this Kibu bag, which is a small diaper bag. It's in the shape of a fanny pack, and I'm so glad that fanny packs are back in style, and I hope they never go back out because I will forever be carrying one, whether it's for the kids, like this diaper bag, or just for myself. I will forever carry one. They're so convenient and functional. So I know before this, I did a video on the Lululemon bag, which is the everywhere belt bag um, that has, you know, its functions. It has its purpose. But this, <laughs> this bag just takes it to the next level. It's giving modern mom. It's giving hot mom summer. It's giving very much fanny pack, but it's a diaper bag as well. This video is not a comparison to the Lululemon bag, but I will say this. The Lululemon bag um, really is just to hold your stuff. Like if you're going out on errands by yourself or if you just don't wanna carry your big purse or your big bag, then that's functional and that's good for that. But if you're going somewhere and you just wanna carry what you need and what your kids need in one bag that's not super heavy and everything can fit into this, then you need to you need to get your hands on this. So the thing I like most about this bag is that you can put your stuff in it and your kids stuff in it. Really the main function of this bag is to keep you from overpacking if you're going out on a day like with your kids and you're going to be doing stuff that's like active. This keeps your stuff and their stuff in one place and it keeps you from overpacking. So like we all have had the experience of having our first kid and we're going out somewhere and the diaper bag is just full of a whole bunch of stuff that we don't need um we put like 50 outfits like just so much unnecessary stuff like five burp cloths blankets like you do not need all that stuff you like you just don't and then especially once your kids get to be toddlers, like they start needing less and less things. So this is really perfect for that. Especially like if you're just really like on the go, going running errands with your kids, you don't wanna have to carry a big diaper bag or your purse in and out of stores, especially if you have to make a lot of stops, then this is perfect because it carries everything that you guys need and it's attached to you. So you don't have to keep putting your bag down, picking it down, putting it, picking it down. Mm putting it down, picking it back up. You just have everything you guys need in one little space. I'll also say this, I will never get rid of a traditional diaper bag um, because like, for example, if I go to church and black people know we've been in church a long time. We personally like, we'll be in church for like three hours on Sundays and like everything that I need within the three, three hour window of time with two toddlers cannot fit into this bag. It is just unrealistic. I need snacks, I need drinks, I need um, diapers, I need wipes, I need literally everything. I need activities, little things to keep them busy. Everything can fit in here for um, a situation like that. But if I'm going to the playground, like you don't need that much stuff at the playground. The kids are running around playing. You don't need that much stuff. So like this is good to invest in because it has its purpose, it has its uses, and then when you need the traditional diaper bag, you can always fall back on that if you need it. Okay, so here's the bag, and I'm gonna show you guys everything that you can put in it, the compartments and the different functions of the bag. So on this front compartment, it has a card slot so that you can put your cards that you need, like your, um, license and a credit card or debit card that you can keep in there so that you don't have to put your wallet in here. So that was a very nice touch that they added onto this bag because it's saves space that you're only putting your cards in here. I like to use this space here for my own personal items. Then there's the main compartment and 
I have a diaper uh, pull up in here left over, but um, this is the main compartment. Inside there is a key ring. So if you wanted to like take off, if you have a lot of keys in your ring, you can take off the like maybe your house key and your car key and just stick them on here. Or you could just put your whole key ring on, to, clip it onto here so that you don't have to lose it inside of the bag. And this is, you can put like diapers and whatever your other needs are for that day inside of this main compartment here. And then on the back, this is the best part about the bag. This part right here is a waterproof wipes compartment. This part keeps your wipes dry for, I think they say on the website, three days up to one week. So you don't have to put the whole pack of wipes in this bag that takes up space. You can just put some wipes in for your day. And then I suggest just taking them out and putting them back inside of a normal wipes container so that they don't dry out if you're not gonna use the bag for like another week or so. And then another awesome part about this bag is this back part here. This is a changing pad that comes with the bag. It rolls out and it detaches so that you can use it wherever you need to use it. And this is actually really, really durable material. It's not cheap. So this is very nicely made. Um, so you can use it, then roll it back up and attach it back so that you have it for the next time you need it. Or if your kids are older like mine and you don't use a changing pad anymore, you can just take that part out and use this for extra storage on the bag. Nothing too bulky because it'll make your bag like misshapen, but it's still extra storage for things you can use on the bag. The strap is adjustable here. And then this is the clip to clip it on and off of your body. All right, so let's pack the bag. I've already put my cards inside of the card, card holder. So now I'm gonna put my hand sanitizer inside. Then I'm gonna put my lip gloss inside. AirPods. And that compartment is finished. Then I'm gonna put two of these pull-ups. If you have smaller diapers, you can fit more, but obviously the bigger the bigger the diaper, the less diapers you can fit inside, but two is enough for my needs. So we're gonna put those on the side here, inside. And then I'm also gonna put my keys in the bottom part here. And then we're gonna take two snacks and put those on top. And we're gonna zip this up. Some people like to put um, water bottles inside of here as well, but if depending on what your priority is to keep in the bag, you have to take some things out to sacrifice some things for something else if it's a, more of a priority for you. Because again, it's not a huge diaper bag. It just helps you to prioritize what you need. Then we're gonna put some wipes inside of the wipes compartment. It's best, I saw on the website that it's best to keep them together like they come in the wipes package instead of taking them individually and stuffing them in because this helps them to retain the moisture. So we're just gonna stick those in like that. Zip that up. And then I don't need the changing pad. So I took that part off and we're gonna put two extra snacks back here. There we go.